Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and it is Saturday so it is a grocery haul day. I have lost and maintained a 140 pound weight loss and I'm going to share with you what I pick up for groceries for the week. Now this haul looks a little bit different, we'll talk about that when we get to the haul, but if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I do a grocery haul every Saturday. Down in the description box I will have nutrition coach highly recommend those personalized macros and calories that is what I follow to lose and maintain my 140 pound weight loss as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for questions accountability or just to talk with me directly links discounts to my favorite things and come join our free Facebook group we would love to have you let's head into the kitchen for the grocery haul So here is my grocery haul for the week. It's a little bit different haul because when you see this video, I'm actually out of town for the weekend. So a lot of this is just some things for Troy while I'm gone, as well as some healthy things when I get home from my trip. So let me show you what I picked up. First, I got this apple pie for Troy. This was $4.23. I thought that would be good for him to have while I'm gone. I also got this whisk because I needed a new whisk and I love that this is silicone. This was $2 dollars and 79 cents it was in their Halloween baking area I also did quite a restock on milk I was out of my fair life milk so I picked that up and then I got two gallons of milk for Troy like I normally do this one was reduced but it's good till the 25th of September so he'll have that gone by then and then this one's actually good until the beginning of October I did pick this up Julia actually brought this when we went kayaking it is a trail mix a chocolate trail mix it has cashews walnuts craisins almonds and like little bits of chocolate I'm going to take this with me on my trip that way I have a healthy fat a healthy snack and it's something that's easily portable and then I did pick up a four pack of green beans for Palm or for Lola, I should say. When I make her homemade food, I do rice, ground turkey, ground chicken, ground beef, whatever. I always put green beans in there and some hard boiled eggs. So I grabbed four more cans of green beans. The Oscar Mayer fully cooked bacon is on sale for $3.99 a pack. That's almost half price. So I picked up two. I only like the extra thick cut if I buy the Oscar Mayer. I prefer the one from Costco, but we're gonna do BLTs. You know how much we love them. So this will be some extra easy bacon. Also got the Mallow Cream Autumn Mix. To refill my little bowl, look at this little thing. My friend Melissa, I went to her house to do crafts. Her little son made me this spider. So stinking cute, I love it. So I, Tori actually put it in the little bowl with the candy corn. So I got this to refill the bowl. I did stop by the meat section and they were having some really great deals, so I grabbed a few things. The 97.3 ground chicken, this is my favorite, was on sale. Well, this one was $4.19 and this one was $4.23. I don't know, don't ask me. But I just tossed my reduced meat in the freezer if I'm not going to use it within the next couple of days. And then I couldn't find any stew meat reduced, so I just grabbed it at regular price. It was $12.50. I am making stew for dinner when I get home. You'll actually see that recipe in Wednesday's what I eat in a day. I do not have a meal plan for you after the video because I'm not meal prepping, so there will not be a meal prep video on Monday since I won't be here. And the only recipe on my radar to make this week is the beef stew, which like I said, you'll see in Wednesday's what I eat in a day, and then BLTs. And then I picked up some chicken breast. This was a really good deal. $6.81. So again, that will just go into the freezer. The Progresso broths were buy one, get one free. And I needed beef broth for the stew. So I picked up a chicken broth as well. I couldn't pass up that deal. And then I needed red wine for the stew recipe. I didn't want a bottle of wine, actual wine, because we don't drink wine. This was a lot less expensive. And it was funny when I went to pay for this, she had to check my ID. So I thought that was funny because it's just red cooking wine. So I grabbed that for the stew. I also picked up two cans of 100% pure pumpkin. I want to make a pumpkin spice latte dupe. Actually, I might do a reel on Instagram. So make sure you follow me on Instagram and maybe we'll do it in my what I eat in a day. But it's using the pumpkin pie protein from Clean Simple Eats because it's back. And then I also want to make my pumpkin waffles with the Devotion Sinful Cinnamon Protein. So I'm so excited for those. So I actually grabbed two cans. I also picked up two more of the Too Good Lemon Yogurt. They still have these. These are seasonal, so I imagine that these will be gone here pretty soon, but I did grab two more. I love this yogurt so much. 
I got quite a bit of lunch meat because Troy makes a lot of sandwiches and things, especially if I'm not here making dinner. This is my favorite lunch meat. It's the Foster Farms. I like the mesquite. I like the regular. They also have honey turkey. No nitrites, no nitrates added, no hormones, and no artificial flavors. So this is my very favorite turkey lunch meat. Unless I'm getting it at Sam's Club, this is my favorite at the grocery store. And then for Troy, I picked up the smoked ham as well as the pastrami. These right now are two for eight. And this one's actually even cheaper. It's only $3.79. This is another thing I got turned on to when I went to my friend Melissa's house. This is Jarlsberg dip. And I will tell you, this is, was expensive and it has a sell by date of tomorrow. So I was like, why is this not reduced? But this was $7.99, but I'm telling you, this is hands down the best dip I've ever had in my entire life. It's not really great for you, but it is so good and it's so good with cucumbers. So I want to have a little bit of this before I head out. So I got the dip and then I got a big English cucumber to slice up for the dip. It would actually be really good in crackers. I don't know what it is about it. It's like crack dip. It's so incredibly delicious. I also got a big, huge bag of onions because I'm completely out of onions. I did need rosemary for the stew and I got this little poultry pack on clearance for $1.31. It has rosemary in there, not to mention some of the other really good spices that you can put in stew. So I picked that up. And lastly, I grabbed two little containers of raspberries. These are currently on coupon for $1.49. So that is a very, very good deal. And that is everything actually that I picked up for the week. Thank you for joining me for this week's grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything that I picked up for the week. I'm excited to come back and get back to my healthy routine, healthy meals. Don't forget that there is not a video tomorrow, Sunday, and there is not a meal prep on Monday, but I will be back to my normal content as soon as I return. So if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Again, subscribe, turn your bell on so you never miss a future video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.